Evelyn. Evelyn is a short story by the Irish writer James Joyce. James Augustine Aloysius Joyce, also known as James Joyce, born on February 2, 1892 in Dublin, Ireland, and died on January 13, 1941. He is an Irish novelist noted for his experimental use of language and exploration of new literary methods in such large works of fiction as Ulysses and Finnegan's Way. The Table of Contents Summary Characters Setting POV Atmosphere and Tone Symbolism And lastly, Theme Summary Evelyn is a young woman living in Dublin with her father. Her mother is dead. Dreaming of a better life being the shores of Ireland, Evelyn plans to elope with Frank. Frank is a sailor who is her secret lover. Evelyn's father having forbid Evelyn to see Frank after the two men fell out to start a new life in Argentina. With her mother gone, Evelyn is responsible for the day-to-day running of the household. Her father is drunk and only reluctant to tips at his share of the weekly housekeeping money, and her brother Harry is busy working and is away a lot on businesses. Another brother, Ernest, has died, so Evelyn herself keeps down a job working in the shop. Characters Protagonist Evelyn, antagonist Mr. Smith, Evelyn's father, supporting characters. Mrs. Smith, deceased mother of Evelyn. Frank, sailor who says he will marry Evelyn after they will go to Argentina to live. Ernest and Harry, Evelyn's brothers. Miss Gavin, divines water guns, little healed. Playmates of Evelyn when she was a child. Organ grinder, a talent street entertainer. Setting The story begins on an evening in a residential section of Dublin, circa 1900 feet. It tends the same evening at the dock where night boat ferry awaits passengers bound to England. POV the story is written in a limited third-person narrative where the narrator tells us what Evelyn does, thinks, and feels. Atmosphere and tone, melancholic and apprehensive. Symbolism, dust and water. Theme, paralysis and epiphany. Today, my heart grieved to say goodbye, but I think goodbyes are sad. This is not a goodbye, my darling, and this is a thank you for you.